How to watch, listen, or stream college football playoff championship. ESPN has several options. The primary broadcast will be on ESPN, with play-by-play -play man Chris Fowler, analyst Kirk Herbstreit, and sideline reporters Holly Rowe, Michigan, and Molly McGrath, Washington, on the call. Unlike what it's done for certain NFL games, ESPN will not be simulcasting the game on over-the-air partner ABC, so a cable-slash-satellite-slash-streaming service subscription will be required to watch at home. To stream the game on ESPN's app, viewers will need to authenticate their subscriptions by logging in through their provider. Here are some of the various presentation options. The CFP Championship game will also have an alternative megacast on ESPN2. Field Pass with the Pat McAfee Show will be anchored by McAfee, who will be on the NRG Stadium sidelines. McAfee will be joined by former NFL players A.J. Hawk and Darius Butler and Anthony DiGilio, Connor Campbell and Ty Schmidt, who are crew members on McAfee's weekday ESPN show. ESPN will air Command Center with a multi-angle presentation featuring player and team statistics in four video feeds that include the main ESPN telecast. Skycam and shots of Michigan coach Jim Harbaugh and Washington counterpart Kalen DeBoer throughout the broadcast. The Skycast presentation on ESP News includes overhead views and shots from behind the offense on most plays. This option will also be available in 4K on Comcast slash Xfinity, DirecTV, Dish Network, Optimum, Sling TV, Verizon, and YouTube TV. The ESPN app will have a hometown radio option where fans can listen to the Michigan or Washington radio feeds synced up with the ESPN telecast. An all-22 feed, which is a coach's film-style view from high above the field showing all 22 players, will be available on the ESPN app with the ESPN radio feed piped in. Fans can also watch the game on the big screen at various theaters in the Houston area. Click here to find the one closest to you. ESPN's YouTube channel will have highlights from the game available in virtual reality. ESPN Deportes will air a Spanish broadcast called by Eduardo Varela, Pablo Viruega, Katia Castorina, and Sebastian M. Christensen. For those who can't watch but want to listen on the radio, ESPN Radio will air the game on 97.5 FM. Sean McDonough, play-by-play, -play, Greg McElroy, analyst, Ian Fitzsimmons, and Chris Budden, sideline reporters, will call the game.